Yeah. Uh, we've got Future and Not Last versus Gohan and RG. These are three heavy hitters. You guys are good to go. We're gonna get right into it. Just a little bit of backstory. Future and Not Last static team. Gohan and RG static team. Both of these teams very adept in South Bay. Obviously, Gohan number three on the Santa Cruz PR. Gohan number three. We got not last number number one on the Santa Cruz PR, and obviously Future, who is rated on both NorCal PR. Yes, and as we mentioned, uh, they also have a very static uh, double combination of the And you've got Gohan RG with their Cloud and Villager. Gohan uh, being a master of many characters, he's able to choose the character when the situation is right. Yes, he is. I mean, we talk about that pretty much all the time. He's got a plethora of characters. And honestly, I talked to him and he says that he literally changes characters for the sole reason of changing it up. Like, that, the fact that he has the luxury of doing that is insane. Yeah, it shows how dedicated a player he is to juggle how much time for these characters and still find success. Yeah, and then getting back into a game one here on Smash. Well, nice tech, actually. We got both of the Sea Fighter boys off the stage. That's always a predicament. But they're actually doing a very good job covering the ledge. Neutral right now from Not Last. He, his, his goal is basically keep Future alive, but didn't back there. Yeah. Each in general, that close ability is going to cause a lot of pressure up close against Not Last. But he needs to use that as a Oh my goodness! Oh my gosh, it was early. The suicide climb hazard! Taking out future stock at. Was, is that literally zero? I think, well, I mean, he, he, yeah, it was literally zero. Well then. And that's a massive disadvantage. So now Not Last Roll needs to dramatically increase in this game. At the worst, he's going to need to save stock so that Future can take him. If he gets skipped again, he's going to get killed with another climb hazard. And he's going to force the stock take. Oh my goodness. Future just losing stock left and right. No regard for... Go <laughs> on, Narji. have no regard for what percent he's at. No, I'm... Off stage. That's not done! No, he's just gonna do it again! Oh, no. <laughs> oh my god, two in a row! And the axe reversal gonna take out Not Last. Now they're both down to one stock apiece. This has been an absolute slaughter so far. It's been just extreme double punch. Oh my god, from Blue Team. Oh, he's not gonna get hit for the forward slash. Oh, the cross slash not connecting. The PK2 not connecting. Nothing really going their way so far. And the follow up is actually gonna take Future's last stock. So now it's up to Not Last against the three stocks of Gohan and RG. RG just gonna need to camp out with that. He got. Oh my goodness! Through, <laughs> taking his stock at 80%. <laughs> I have no words for that. That was absolute savagery. That is the kind of game where you just have to say, okay, if there's one thing we do in game two, don't let that happen again. <laughs> you just... The, it's like when he got grabbed and you knew that the back throw into the tree was coming, it's, it's like that horror movie. It's like a horror movie when you know, like, you're going to die. Literally everybody's in suspense for what happens next. It's just, it's just a matter of when it happens. <laughs> That was incredible from Gohan and RG. Wow. And what a strong game one to start out this set. Is this oh, yeah. best of five? No, this is loser's quarter, so it's best of three. Juan, best of three. Best of three. Best of three. Best of three. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, loser's semis is best of five. That is, an that is probably one of the most extreme ways I've seen a best of three start. <laughs> <laughs> the, the 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 best part was that uh, Gohan was so aware of the situation that he was totally okay with sacrificing his stock if he knew he was gonna get the climb hazard. Exactly. And Kill. Those moments where he just knows what he needs to do. That yeah. Lead to moments where Future loses four consecutive stocks. <laughs> I mean, it's it's a little bit of a symptom of how linear Ness's recovery is once he's in PK form. As soon as as soon as he starts PK Thunder, you can really just run off and do that. And that's kind of what we saw. They exploited his recovery, and this goes back to what I was saying. Not last role in this game is to keep Future alive, and that means distracting RG or whoever whoever's edge guarding Future. Really distract Gohan. 
and that's the, adapt that's the adaptation I think they're going to need to make because the more they get future off stage in these situations, and you see that they've actually forced switch Pikachu. Yeah. That is also something I want to mention. Future going to his Pikachu, honestly. There's a character that he's just as equipped in, but like a little bit less probably. Yeah. However, he's going to have the great advantage of being able to recover a bit more consistently. Yep. Uh, not only consistently, but he's going to be able to recover a lot more erratically. They're not going to be able to predict exactly how he how he recovers with which time. Oh, uh, not which time. Quick attack. Uh, that's and pretty much it. Yeah. 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 It's oh man. Big cross slash coming out, taking off not last first stock, allegedly. It's really a uh, weakness of Peach in general. When she's caught in the corner like that, and I guess the character like Cloudy gets a lot of options to just cover whatever she does. Yeah, he does. Oh, uh, that might actually be it for. Oh, neither of them. <gasps> Great recovery. Actually saving RG right there. And now, they're doing a very good job of just not being old. It was probably a work trade for him. Yeah. Hitting the down smash and taking off Future's first stock is probably what they want now that Mark is in stock tank. Yes. And that was actually that was actually the first stock in this set that Gohan lost against his will. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, you can really tell him that Red Team did make adjustments for sure. Oh yeah. And now it's looking a lot more evil. I mean, the big adjustment I'm seeing is the fact that they're just able to hold neutral due to the frame data on Pikachu and Peach. Peach has been actually using floating a lot more efficiently in this game than- OH MY GOD! Gosh, and the savage fight coming out from Gohan right there. Taking off no, a second stop. Oh my god, this, this kid! He's a child! No, is he gonna kill him again?! Oh my goodness! Okay, future, one of the redeeming moments. That could shift the momentum in the favor of Red Team, but that, okay, Gohan is mad. Yeah, and he's very angry right now, and showing his play. Back from the future right now. Okay, you can see that was a potential setup right there, the part was convenient in the spot. Where yeah. Cut back to Alright. The back row RG much more important in the cloud and actually was able to take out the future stock right there. Red team, they've got a they've definitely gotta take out the future stock first. Like if oh, they yeah. can get if they can get cloud, that's good. But just evening up the stock is what they need to do. I really don't want to see Peach with rage just because the parasol knockback increases, but at the same time, they really need to kill her because she's got more percentage. That's gonna do it! Good at He's gonna try it again! That's gonna do it! Wow! Oh my god! Just absolute destruction! From Future's recovery without even hitting his teammate. That is positioning right there. That's like, that's synergy. Oh my goodness, that was a slaughter. And we're gonna see if we can actually get. We can put Winner's Finals up on stream next. That's going to be Gohan and RG moving on to uh, Losers Semis, where they'll be taking on the winner of 3XA and Moog, and then Rude and Sean, wow. who uh, I Wait. feel like that's an upset. Yeah, I think Rude and Sean, they're sitting in Losers Finals at the moment. No, they're, losing, they're sitting in Losers sem uh, Quarters. Oh, we're going into the other losers quarters. So no, we're 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 actually going into winners finals right now, mm. and uh, the loser of that is going to be sitting in losers finals. On the top half of the bracket, we got three X eight move versus Rude and Sean. We just saw Gohan and RG take out Future Not Last. The winner of three X eight move and Rude and Sean will move on to losers semis, and the winner of that will move on to fight the loser of our winners finals that will be coming up right now. Now I don't know about you, 